OG, I need some advice. The girl said she wants to focus on us, but recently she was entertaining this one dude, and she told me she stopped talking to him, but I don't trust her now. What should I do? That's not your bitch. That's not your bitch. Like, oh my God. Like, I feel like, I feel like, I feel like sometimes if a woman don't operate like how y'all want, I want her to, like, like, y'all be crashing. Like, you, like, these women lie. And we do too. We live in hell. That's, that's just starting to sink in my mind. Like, we live in hell. This is no perfect thing. You got to fend for yourself, bro, and keep everything to yourself, bro. This is not no perfect world. So if she moving like that and you don't like that game, you retract yourself and you get some motion. So it burns her. That's the only way if you want it to burn her. If you don't want to be petty, just leave her alone. Um, Why do people care so much about fits the first date? I am broke. I can't afford no full nice ass fit. <laughs> I don't even know what to say like gig I don't know what to say bro like I'm just gonna drink my water bro <laughs> nigga saw mad hurt through the text like <laughs> nigga saw mad hurt like <laughs> okay bro I'm sorry to hear that bro hmm I already told y'all niggas the, the source. Y'all gotta cry to your parents. If y'all niggas was listening and applied the method, y'all would have been cried to your parents a month in advance. So y'all could have got that nice fits. You can cry discreetly. Um, it's my last day at SYEP tomorrow. <laughs> y'all niggas money done. <laughs> y'all niggas money is finished. Like, <laughs> y'all niggas was enjoying that little check. It's fine. It's fine. SYP is a good experience though. Um OJ, how you make sure that when you go out your hair and braid it out of the barber don't give you that weird hairline? Um beach of hair. Sir, I need English. You can still be a drippy you can still be drippy on a budget. Just know how to put it together. i I definitely agree, like okay, like But it's getting hard, you know, like you still can be drippy on a budget, but it's like when these niggas is wearing they chrome hearts, these niggas is wearing that shit like first day, like, niggas, bro, the most you were seeing a nigga with in high school, bro, when I was in 9th, 10th grade, was maybe, maybe a fucking, maybe one nigga had a Goyard belt, maybe, and a, and a couple Ferragamo belts, y'all niggas be, y'all niggas be moving bad now, y'all niggas be moving, look who babe, look who two babe hoodies, you was extra fly. Oh, my school, my school refund looking mad nice. Let me fly you out. That's your priorities. Sheen, Sheen and pa Panda by Demon. MCM bags. I always thought MCM bags were so nasty. I don't like them. I, the only one that ever looked acceptable to me was the woman's um, pink one. That was like okay for a time. For niggas, bro, MC and Bad look mad ghetto. Um, play. Play girl. Play girl. Ash. Thank you. I appreciate you. Genuinely. Bringing out B22s. It was raps. Oh my god. And they glaze people, like, even recording them when they got fake or cheap shit on. It's literally so weird, honestly. <laughs> bro, bro, like. I feel like it's really the dynamic of New York. Like, I'm pretty sure most of us live in the city. So it's like, just think about this. Like, just because we live in New York, we're forced to an extent to know how to dress. Like, the most bummiest, like the nigga who cannot dress, like, like the nigga who cannot dress for shit, like the straight of Mary's with the stars, like, and <laughs> Celine shirt or whatever. Like, them niggas go to South Dakota or them little states where... It just be racism and, and trees. Them niggas got them niggas don't know what drip is like, so they're extra drippy. I feel like in New York, you just need to know how to dress like it's a city of fashion, so you're kinda like peer pressured into that from very young. What chapstick do you use? I don't use chapstick. I use this and I use like um what else? I use this and this. But niggas be thinking my lips is mad dry. Like, I don't know. Maybe they just look burnt. Um. Anyways, let's talk about some. Let's talk about. Let, what's going on that's traumatic that. 
I be saying put trauma. I be talking about a girl start talking to you like what? Y'all don't got no trauma, bro. Let's 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 talk about some trauma, bro. Blue magic on his lips. Your mouth is full with dick. Can you read, boy? How dumb do you feel, boy? How dumb do you feel, boy? Sit down while your chest hurts, nigga. You feel dumb. You can't type nothing. You just feel and look dumb behind your screen. You're dumb. You're dumb. You like to glaze. You enjoy it. Now, you feel yourself. You feel yourself glazing yourself. It's not a good feeling, boy. Niggas, nah. You needed, you needed that. That's going to cause some character development, especially if you're going to school tomorrow. Don't glaze niggas, because niggas might box you up in college, bro. It's not high school, bro. It might really box you up, bro. I needed that. How to fix your sleep, your sleep schedule? King, I don't know about that, bro. I'm not there yet. <laughs> Nigga talking about sleep schedule. Look what time, bro. I don't, my, my shit is deteriorated, bro. I messed with a nigga that shared the same bape, purple jeans, and fives with, with his mans, and they both posted wearing the same fit. Bro, these niggas, these niggas, these niggas can't even be bums discreetly. Come on, gang. Come on, gang. Look at this nigga's drama. I don't really spend time with my dad ever. Oh, never mind. I didn't know it started like that. My fault. I don't really spend time with my dad ever. Then I went to Jamaica and he was driving me and my mom somewhere. And someone called him and he said he was in the car with strangers. What? Am I slow right now? Am I slow? I don't really spend time with my dad ever. I went to Jamaica and he was driving me and my mom somewhere. And someone called him. And he said he... Oh, oh my God, that's so traumatic. I couldn't even register it in my mind. Gang, I'm so sorry. <laughs> no. Yo, I could... Yo, that shit didn't even sink in my mind, the trauma. Yo, yo, you need a prayer, bro. Nah, I'm not even laughing, bro. Like, I'm just... Nah, bro. Niggas can't laugh. Niggas... I'm here. Nigga on the phone in front of you and your mom talking about he with strangers. But then again, like, okay. This is not healthy, right? But I'm gonna ask you because some people experience this. Like some people, yeah, like as Car having Caribbean parents, like some some of our fathers, bro, they really be moving like whores, bro. So in that case, like I definitely know some people who grew up seeing their father cheat. So have you? Is, does your father cheat? Does he casually cheat? Like, are you sure it wasn't a woman on the phone? And I don't know how to lighten your trauma game. This is a lot. Prayers. We need a prayer. I'm praying. I'm praying. God, I'm asking you to bless um TKTT and just um allow her to be a little bit more um mentally better and have some resilience for these type of situations. Amen. We need that. Amen. Amen. Um my siblings have resent resentment towards me. Hold on. Let me let me let me let me search. Let me search. My siblings um have resentment towards me because my parents were soft on me. But in reality, I learned from their mistakes. And my mom, Hispanic Caribbean, is single, so I don't stress her out. But they steady making me feel guilty for being a good kid. I don't know what that, what, what's that about. Like, I don't even know. That's so sad to hear when people are not, when people don't really get along with their siblings. Because I feel like when you have a sibling, it's supposed to be your main man. You see what I'm saying? And when people be having situations, and I be hearing stories where nigga siblings be sneaking them out. And I da, 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 da. It's just like, bro, that's so sad to hear. Me and my siblings not locked in, but like, we're really, we're cool, but we don't fake our relationship. Like, my brother's just way older than me, like, way older, like, got kids. One of my brothers, my dad is mad old, bro. One of my, one of my um brothers got a kid damn near my age, like a year apart from me. So it's like, but they cool. Like, I'm an adult now, like, we chill, but it was never no beef. Um, but I'm sorry to hear that. Genuinely, I hope I can't even say I hope that situation get better. If you know that it's it's done up, bro, and you're, and 
you won't really rekindle a relationship or have the relationship you'd like to with them. You just have to get some mental res resilience in a sense and try to like be comfortable with not being locked in with them. Even though that's hard to see, it's going to take some time and a long time too. Okay, so you see, you just trying to flirt with me. This is not iMessage. OJ, then you, you see, you can never get a nigga. For y'all girls that talk to niggas and y'all want to text niggas and y'all text them by their name in, 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 in all caps, the femininity, the femininity is locking through iMessage. Okay? OJ, my birthday is on Sunday and I'm planning to be outside like real bad, like late night thing, and I'm trying to decide if I should even go back home when the night's over. I'm not your nigga. This sound like Mantisa. Structure. We need structure. We need structure. Bro, I didn't even want to know that my views was out of cable. Like, I feel like sometimes when streamers know their views, they get too overwhelmed with like, oh, I gotta act this way. I gotta move this way. I gotta come off extra entertaining. Like, I don't, I would never want it to be that. So that's why I actually had not to mention it. But thank you. Why guys continue to be sweet to their ex even though they're not together? They want pum pum bro. Or like, you know, let me not even use it from that. It could be I feel like in general they want pum pum. They still like it. Um you ain't see that thing it was something on TikTok, bro. And bro, I won't bro. It was a thing on TikTok where a nigga was had to live with his ex, but like they been broke up and then she had a boyfriend that he didn't know about the whole time and he was living in the house too something like that and then she recorded a, a video fucking her ex and then posted it on only fans while her nigga was living in the we live in hell we live in hell there's some things bro at the end of the day maybe the time maybe the day i decide to seriously date is when a chip can be in the both of our minds so I really know how you feel about me call me laced call me laced <laughs> earth needs a rest <laughs> a reset um bro this is a we live in a bro I don't even want my body to shiver talking about whack people and relationships bro mm -mm -mm. <laughs> My neighbor brother lives with his wife, but they never got divorced, and he lives with his GF in the same house with his wife. So his, so his wife be fucking niggas in the crib. Tough T, don't lie to me, gang. This is from Bobby's. <laughs> niggas love lying. Don't gas me up now. This shit from Bobby's, bro. This shit is, I could pick this shit off, bro. I feel like I'm back in school already. Now, nah, OG, you ask for trauma. You're not helping us. You're reading Bear Skunt. Okay, put your comment in there and let's analyze. I feel like some Caribbean auntie was just lining me up, like <laughs> taking a summer course, and I, it's supposed to be studying for my fi final right now. I want this shit to be over so bad. I don't even want to study right now. But how everybody doing? Nigga, go study. You talking about how everybody doing? I should fake time you out. I should fake do the right thing. I should do the right thing and time you out for today, bro. What's up with this nigga? I did react to the um the bra. The whole bra thing, like, that's what they get, um, that's what our ancestors wanted. It's crazy that, that that's where they used to sh um dot the ships with our ancestors. So I'm I think it's just um a retaliation, more internal. Hey OG, I've been thinking about starting a YouTube channel for a while now and I finally have the guts. Any tips? Also love the content. Keep going. What I do understand is that the majority of people who like watch me, like, yeah, I do think about sometimes that you yeah, do want to have a YouTube. And what you need to look at is that you need to authentically be yourself. I don't think that you should wait until you get equipment because a lot of the times, like, you know, financial situation is not good. You can't start on your phone. A lot of people start on their phone. I feel like if you're genuinely yourself and you are likable, it's going to... You, you're going to see if you're likable or not. Even if you're really not that likable, there's always somebody that will like you. So I feel like you just need to start. And don't be so generic. If you want to make YouTube videos like your favorite person, you can. But always try to add your little twist to it, you know? 
it doesn't make sense to start YouTube if you're gonna stop and be cons in inconsistent. Because what you have to realize is, the majority of the time, because you're not getting views, it's not because like you're not entertaining or you're not doing well. It's just content is oversaturated, and sometimes people just want to see a familiar face before they really watch you. So that's what I think. I need a PC. You don't even need a PC for real, bro. Like if you want to do YouTube, you don't need a PC, bro. You can you can use CapCut, bro. You can get your phone and get a tripod and an extended tripod, and you'll be fine. Lotte, I heard about that. Um, OJ, is there a video or a Twitch moments you you had that uh, that is that embarrassed that went viral? Embarrassed? I'd probably say the only time I really felt embarrassed is when I said something, but it got misconstrued. So I felt like people genuinely didn't like me, but it was because of a comment I don't align with. Like when people don't like me, that's fine. But when it's from something and it's misconstrued, it's basically the Ethiopia thing. Yeah, I remember that little thing and it was just mad Ethiopian people felt like I didn't like them, but it was took out of context. Um, They say they was lying about Lizzo now. So I gotta take that back. Lizzo, nobody's perfect. I apologize. I apologize for roasting you. Like, I'm always gonna apologize if I roast some money and it's I apologize. It's not embarrassing, but the clip when um he called you bent, that was hilarious. Yeah, it was funny. It was funny. When something is funny, I laugh. Like when niggas roast me and it's funny, don't I always laugh? E even when he was doing the diss wars and the roast was so bad, nigga I laughed. So it's like if it's funny I'ma laugh. OJ make me laugh with the jokes at Buki. Shorty making me uncomfortable, bro. <laughs> she making me mad uncomfortable. Like, you don't, you don't, you don't. Yo, so what's up? Thank you for that sub. Y'all don't understand. Like, when you hit niggas with the buki, like, first it was like, pukarooks. What that was funny. Then it was like buki. Buki is like that sound mad tree. She like niggas. You have. The girl who say Buki is the girl that wanna interrogate you and, and, and search around your whole room and she must leave with a sweater. So I had enough experiences. I'm going to be a sophomore in high school. I got all my academic shit last year. <laughs> Hold on, and my goal for this year is to have a GF. What should I do? You having a goal to have a GF? For your for your sophomore year is crazy. Let's TP, bro. Like you gotta re you gotta reread that out loud. We got rated. We got rated by who? Oh, Tony, Tony. How do I pronounce that? I appreciate you, bro. Genuinely, I gotta go think up your Twitch now, bro. Gotta go get that. Gotta go support you with my little motion. You know, you know. Thank you, bro. I appreciate that. I just checked you out. Um, what are you doing after college, OJ? <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Like, there's a project I've been working on that, like, I feel like I have a new passion, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I haven't spoke about it to anyone but my main mans. And, like, i just been working on it, like, every time I'm not in front of my screen and, like, I'm not on my phone or, like, you know, doing my Are we back workout. or what? Bro, why I feel like I, I heard a demon? Am I tweaking? Are we back? Are we back? My oh, girl oh, said oh, we're oh, not oh, back. Oh, oh. So I don't know. Oh, so my girl oh. says we're not back. We're not back yet. Yo. Yo. My heart just beat. <laughs> yo, I'm like. Yo. <laughs> yo. I, it was a tab. It was a tab. I, was, I thought I was losing my mind. Like. <laughs> My full game, my full game. It's cause I um I followed you. Yo, <laughs> yo. Alright, I'm gonna tell y'all where the cop clothes from right now. Go on Instagram. Type in one of one LA. 
one of one something like that or why don't you just look through my following oh yeah i'm gonna see mad gal though it's gonna take you a minute <laughs> it's gonna take you a minute i have a whole link that i send out but i be getting mad people like texting me so i don't always get to send anybody like the drip link that i got hello good night hello good night um so pin tony comments so ojc OJ, I've been taking your advice and I started posting my stream clips on TikTok, but it's hard to find topics to speak about when you don't have a community to interact with. How do I build one that doesn't glaze? <laughs> Honestly, I feel like this is what a lot of streamers do, like a lot of small streamers do before they blow up. They'll react to something on YouTube and act like they're speaking to someone or they just react to a video like and have it recording on OBS. So it seems like they're speaking to a chat. But then they just upload it. But there's no space for a chat. So you wouldn't even know that there was in a chat. Nigga said, accept the glees. My father beat me and had affairs. I was constantly at the front of the parents beefing. I'm the only boy in the family too. I was raised by my sisters and female cousins. And my feminine energy is strong. I got bullied and targeted through school. I'm so, I'm so sorry to hear that, bro. Genuinely. I'm genuinely sorry to hear that, bro. And what I'm learning, like, I don't even feel like men should really be ashamed of feminine energy. Like, what I'm learning, like, but I'm really learning that through spirituality. So that's not something I can prove. But, like, I'm learning that it's just a balance to us with feminine energy. And everybody has, like, both parts to a certain extent. And the other, uh, but, like, nothing's wrong with that, bro. And if niggas are bullying you in school, like, it's so hard to be, like, when someone's dealing with bullying. I think you need to know how to roast or know how to or know how to fight or just both you'll be you'll be bro it don't matter how you present yourself in school like say you came off like the weirdest nigga say you came off like them ATL niggas the ATL benders we was talking about but you can really fight or you just like had somebody order that really taught you how to fight or at least defend yourself and like you won a couple fights niggas are not messing with you nigga said or shoot <laughs> Nigga said or shoot. Oh my god. I just got into stream. What happened? A whole bunch of things happened. I don't even know if I want to repeat it. Lord have mercy. Can you watch the news? This nigga is talking. This nigga is just talking right now. What was that girl? You know what girl I didn't want to speak to? I wanted to speak to that girl. Like, I think your name is Jai something. J-A-I. Like, you had the, um, your little spam page. That's after stream. Nigga said, can you watch the news? <laughs> I'm going to show y'all some stuff, though. What the fuck? Yo, I feel like a duck. Yo, what's up my dad? Like, okay. I don't want to come off like I'm tweaking. The girl who was hiding from her nigga. Who's, she said she didn't have a nigga. She said she didn't have a nigga. Yes, I'm talking to you. But we don't know that. We don't know that. So, I'm going to say this, right? When I had the, um... When I... When I when I had the free crib, mind you, I had the, How long did I have the free crib? Like a week? A week plus? Bro. Word to my dad. And I didn't say it on stream because it was very serious, bro. Word to my dad. I was feeling schizophrenic, bro. Have y'all ever been al alone by yourself so long y'all feel that way? Or maybe I'm tweaking, bro. I was feeling schizophrenic, bro. Like, I was enjoying that shit. But when it got to, like... When it got to, like... Bro, where to my dead, like... <laughs> yo! Yo, and my mother did not help me. Remember, we still live in a trench crib, bro. See what I'm saying? Like... <laughs> we still live in a trench... So, the way how my crib operates, like... There's one extremely long hallway. And it's like you walk through the hallway and then every like other passageway or room is on the left side. And then my room is all the way at the end. So when I open up the door, I see that hallway. But because nobody's here, like the light's not on. I have one light. The light started to flicker two days ago. What else happened? There was like there was a spider. There's a spider that like Bro, I was working out. I said I decided like, yo, I'm gonna do my little push-ups in the living room. Like niggas at the free crib. Like I'm gonna do my little push-ups in the living room. I said that's whatever, whatever. As I'm doing a push-up, I see a spider like 
shot its way to me. So I, that was probably the most bent I ever got up in my life. I can't even demonstrate, but best believe I got up bare quick. I got up bare quick. It's like I aimed with my, with, with, it's like I aimed with my feet and I, mm. Now mind you, my windows are down. So, fake after my workout, I'm fake disgusting now. Like, I just go back to my room. Next morning, like, I go to go pre the thing, pre the, pre the fucking, um, yai, the demons. <laughs> like, bro, I'm not even lying about this shit, bro. Like, we're to my dad. Like, I think I'm tweaked out. Like, I was talking to my mom earlier about this shit. So, I go back in the morning. I just, I'm just pre the scenery, you know. I control the house. I'm pre the scenery. I'm pre the scenery. I peep. The bug moved. From where I initially stomped it. And it moved OD. So now I'm like, no, maybe I'm tweaking, bro. Now I'm like, I'm really, I must be tweaking. I must be tweaking, bro. So now I'm like, fuck it. 3 a.m. I spin back. The bucket is not there. I'm I'm holding my flash underneath the couch. I'm like, no, I gotta be tweaking, bro. I'm like, I gotta be tweaking, bro. So I'm like, no, I'm tweaking. Then I started hearing like, I ain't hear no voices. Like, I'm never s- going to sit here and lie. But I definitely heard some sounds. Like, nothing's supposed to be moving if the window's closed. So I was hearing some sounds, and I'm like, yo, gang, like, I'll be very honest. I'm going to speak to y'all because this may, make, this, may view, this may make y'all view me like I'm tweaked out, okay? But I genuinely have times where I will feel a presence in my room that is not a welcoming presence. And now that I talk out loud, I never told anybody this because how am I gonna tell my I'm gonna tell a girl this? She gonna not talk to me. I'm like I'm next. I'm just venting right now. And I'll be like, gang, not today, bro. Like where to? I'm having a conversation out loud. Like I could be cleaning my room. I could be like, you know, I could just like I'm having my own con- bro. Let me demonstrate to y'all what I be doing because it's like I just I have no area to explain it, bro. Hold on. Okay, so y'all hear me properly? Y'all hear me good? So, like, I'll be in my room, like... Let's pray. Now, let's pray before I say it. Because now, like, I've been having so much stories, bro. I just talking. Father God, any entities that would like to come here, we're just denying them out of here. And I'm speaking through the screen. Um, And, yeah, I'm very serious, Lord. No joke this time. Amen. We need that. We need that. We need that. We need that. Okay, now. So, I'll be in my room. I'll be folding my clothes. And I'll feel a presence, like. And I'll be like, I may be on some casual shit. Because, you know, nobody's watching me. Nobody's hearing me. I'll be on some shit like, bro. Not today, bro. Not today, bro. <laughs> I'll be like, not today, bro. Like, niggas got shit to do. Like, I'm not trying to do that. Like, this whole sleep paralysis thing. You can move out. Now, to be like, I hear voices. It's cap. But I feel like this nigga can communicate with me. I feel like I get the nigga's vibe. I'm not gonna lie and say I hear voices, cause I don't. But I get this nigga vibe. I could get a vibe like, this nigga would fake sigh and be like, ah, you got it. Nobody, I'm not gonna lie, but that's what I feel. That's what I feel. So, <laughs> that's what I feel. So like, I don't know, like, so like, if I do that, I feel like the nigga will still linger around. Like, say I open my door and I go to the bathroom. I'll be like, bro, like, don't follow niggas in the room. Like, just leave. Like, go about your business. You don't be here every day. Like, just cool out. The one day I don't talk, the audio cutting out. Okay, are we good now? Okay, I'm going to speak about that. Are we good now? Okay, but y'all was understanding everything I was saying, though, right? Oh, I have to re re-say what I was saying. Okay. So, yeah, like, it's like the one day I don't talk, that's when, like, I really get sleep paralysis, bro. You see what I'm saying? And it's like, the demons is here, bro. So, I tell my mom. I'm like, ma. And I waited till I was like, she was in the room, and I was like, okay, I'm going to wait till she get up. So I waited like two hours. I went back. She was still sleeping. But she was like, come, come. 
I'm like, man, like, no joke. Because she loved to think I'm joking. Like, man's, bad man's not joking, bro. So I catch up in the room. Like, you know when you have to have a... You know when your mom don't want her, you don't really want you in the room. So you got to close the door and put your back against the door. So now my back is against the door. I'm like, mom. <laughs> I'm like, no joke. Like, I feel like when you was gone, there were spirits in the crib. She can't comfort niggas. She like, there might have been. So I'm looking at her, I'm like, my what type of time? You're like, you say, mind you, my ma is a old, T spiritual woman. Like, I don't even like, it's no cop. This is not something that's been going on through social media. Like, my mom has always been a very spiritual person. Like, I don't have times my mom had her candles and stuff. My dad, come and you come in the crib. You see the candles? He will, and for y'all that know, y'all know, like, no, no scented candles. Like, them specific color candles for the time, like, moon or whatever. And my dad would come and say, I don't want this to be on here. <laughs> I can't even be too loud. <laughs> I can't even be too loud. <laughs> you went to my dad on my old snap. I ha- <laughs> Bro, like, this nigga, like, there's no stopping this nigga. Like, <laughs> there's no stopping this nigga. That's a whole nother story time, bro. So, like... So, like, she like, there might have been. What did you do? I'm like, bro, I told them... I told them... I told them niggas to leave. She like, that's what you have to do. Whenever you feel spirits, whenever a spirit come to your house, or come, you're supposed to say, you... Spirit, you are not welcome here. Leave now. So, you know, I put it in my notes. And I'm prepared for the next engagement. What are, What else am I supposed to say, bro? So, my chest, okay, that's enough. My chest tingling. Let me sit back down. I don't feel like I'm, I don't feel like I'm supposed to speak about that for so long. Are there any stories of girls that you brought to your family? I ain't gonna lie, gang, like, for y'all niggas, like, one thing, this is what makes me feel like a nigga don't respect his mother, right? This is what made me feel like a nigga don't respect his mother. I feel like when y'all niggas be cool with y'all mom and y'all just be okay with kind of like introducing every girl or like just casually bringing every girl around your mother, like what type of time y'all niggas be on? No, no, like, no, like. If I have a girl over, like most likely my mom's not home or other than that, like I'm just doing that out of respect. Like I'm not gonna, every girl I, I fuck with, I'm gonna just, no, that's OD bro. Niggas still saying in the name of Jesus. No, I'm not, I'm not. Nah, bro, I'm not even joking. I seen a shadow run across the TV in the back. You was trying to look at you. You was trying to. You was trying. You thought the text to speech was gonna come on. Not for the one dollar, for the five dollar. So you tried to scare me with that deep voice. It didn't work. It didn't work. OJ, you eat pussy. You just don't even know how to insert anything. OJ, I'm not even trying to grease you, but maybe a rodent ate the spider. Nigga, fuck you. You lucky, like, you lucky I can't even say nothing to that. Like, I just gotta let that shit burn. Like, nigga, fuck you. Like, <laughs> I'm not jacking. Like, you know, the reason I'm not jacking that is because one, one, the same mouse I've been talking about, that nigga has not been here. Since the last time I told you about the mouse and if I was wondering if it would come back in the crib, I have not seen that mouse since. I'm going to keep it a buck. I live in the bush. I'm not going to lie. See what I'm saying? Somebody talking about... who talk, Somebody talking about Carisha or I'm Because I seen somebody said leave her alone. Somebody talking about Carisha because we don't tolerate that here. I seen a hand on the bottom right corner just now. I ain't going to lie, gang. Your name is Twist... Your name is Twist Drips. So... Whatever you think, you just gotta change your name before niggas accept what you think. You too honest? 
Bro, I live in a trench, bro. Like, what else? What I gotta, bro? What I gotta lie about, bro? Um, <laughs> what if the mouse could speak? Would you be cool with it? Nah, cause the mouse dirty. I gotta be cool with clean. The mouse, you no. Know, 